Hello, welcome back. This is Karen with the next lesson on which is tool number one of the Change Your Man Toolkit. This tool is called Radical Request. And when might you use this? Well, you know, most women that I've spoken to don't like nagging their husbands or asking their husbands to help them. They expect to have some help, of course, particularly if, they're, if both he and she are working, but they don't like to nag. They expect their husbands to know what they want or to be able to see what needs to be done around the place. But the tool in this instance is to actually ask him, tell him what you want done. And that's because men cannot mind read. Men haven't been brought up to be observant around the place about what needs done. I guess that's because growing up, they weren't constantly following their mum around doing the vacuum cleaning or cleaning the bathroom. You know, these are the things that women tend to observe and they tend to take on as their own responsibility. And they think that men should see it and do it without being asked, but they don't. So if you want it done, tell him, ask him, and be really clear about what you want done because men also don't like hints. They don't get it when you hint, when you beat around the bush, it drives them to distraction. So men have said to me, I wish she would just tell me and I wish she would tell me in a nice voice. See, that's the other key. When you want something done, don't be sarcastic or critical as though, you know, he should have seen it or he should have done it and he isn't doing it somehow because he wants to hurt you or annoy you. Not at all. If, if you don't ask, he presumes you don't need help. It's as simple as that. So if you ask, just ask nicely. Say, could you please do this? Or could you put on dinner tonight? Or would you please you know, start dinner before I come home tonight? Because if you ask nicely, they're happy to help. They want to be able to help the woman that they love. And they want to be able to make her happy. I mean, happy, what do they say? Happy, happy wife, happy life. They like to make their woman happy. They just often don't know how to do it. Don't expect them to be able to mind read. Tell them, tell them nicely. Tell them in a non-critical voice. Spell it out for them, they're happy to do that. You know, a lot of men say to me that they married a princess, they married somebody who was soft and warm and gentle and encouraging. But as the years go by, this woman of theirs seems to get, you know, nastier and louder and more critical and nagging. They end up calling her a dragon woman. No man wants to be married to a dragon woman. So try and keep the sarcasm and the criticism down. And if he does a task that you've asked him, don't tell him that he did it wrong. Don't remind him that he hasn't done it properly. Don't even tell him that there's an easier way to do it. That's what men hate. If you ask them to do it, let them do it in their own way. Don't criticize, just be happy that it's done. Be grateful that it's done. And also know that the more they do it, the better it's going to get. Practice makes perfect. So this is the major tool. You'll read a lot more in the lesson and there's also a worksheet at the end of this lesson about nagging and what nagging means and what it actually does to your man, what it does to you as well. So that is the end of this little video about the radical request. Take care.